The Reverend Tim McDonald is a Baptist minister and civil rights leader from Atlanta, Georgia. His experience of a God who speaks to him fits a classic pattern of theist mysticism. It happened when he was only 16, an orphan living alone in a public housing project. The experience set the direction for the rest of his life. After my, my mother died, my family was rather scattered, and I kind of lived alone for a while uh, in the, the project of public housing where we lived for some 18 years. And one night while in the room by myself, in the house by myself, God and I had a very serious dialogue about what he had done, taking my, my mother and, and my father. Uh, and I was convinced after that, that dialogue that God had a special plan for my life and that it was out of the death of my mother and father that this plan was to come about. But as the dialogue kind of continued, and I'm, I'm not even sure if it wasn't really an audible dialogue, it wasn't just sitting there contemplating, I mean, I honestly believed that I was talking, I, I was speaking, and I could hear myself, and I could hear God as well. Um, it was an awesome kind of experience for me, very um, relieving. It, it, it was to the point where I felt almost as if I wanted to mount a transfiguration. And it was a glorious experience. All the burdens that I had 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 and all the troubles and problems seemed to just evaporate uh, as the, the dialogue was taking place. And certainly after the dialogue was ended, it was just a calm, restful period of sleep, of tranquility, and of the assurance that from that point on, no matter what came, everything was going to be all right. And to this day, that has proven to be true.